for the championship. Introducing the challenger, representing the Brothers of Destruction from Chelsea, England, weighing in at 272 pounds, Dan Lewis. Well, this guy looks eager to add some gold around his waist. Let's see if he can do it. This guy certainly has his game face on. Beating him tonight is not going to be easy. It's never easy. Introducing the challenger, representing the family. From Chelsea, England, weighing in at 188 pounds, Hicks. Well, the champion better be ready, because this challenger looks primed to strike. You know, I don't think the challenger has any plans on wasting this golden opportunity. And introducing the champion from Tokyo, Japan. Weighing in at 304 pounds, he is the SmackDown Heavyweight Champion, the Samurai Joe. Well, there's a reason why this guy's the champ, and I think he's about to show us what that reason is. If you think it's hot outside, just wait for the opening bell. Huh, this one's gonna be blistering. Uh, we are seconds away from the start of this title match. And we're underway with triple threat action. There's no question that this one's gonna be a struggle. An outright battle of wills. Three superstars, but only one can emerge victorious. Your guess is as good as mine as to who it's going to be. But hey, by the sounds of it, this crowd is ready for anything that happens tonight. As the action progresses, let's briefly talk about the challenger. Here we go in this triple threat match. What can he do to get the best of the other two superstars in there? What about the other two in the ring? We're looking at three of the absolute best WWE has to offer. Yeah, and I circled this triple threat the second I saw it on the schedule. Great storylines here. Oh man, I would not want to be on the receiving end of one of those kicks.
He wants no part of the outside. And I don't blame him. Nothing good ever happens outside the ring. Hit with a swinging neck breaker. Painful. No kidding. You may have to be carried out after that. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Come on! Now he just wants that insult to injury. Yeah, this guy's a mean streak. And there's the head scissors takedown, commonly known as the Hurricane Rana. Great move. It is a great move, and you're going old school when you refer to it as head scissors. The challenger's taking on some offense. To be expected, though, it's not like he's in there with a the slouch, guys. But it's important to know that this... Uh-oh, he's cutting off the flow of air. Ah! And he escapes the hole. Man, DDT'd right on his face. Simply put, any offense that lands above the shoulders can change the outlook of a match in an instant. That had to hurt. With a move like that, your career could be over just like that. No kidding. This is serious. Come on, ref. Here's a cover. When this guy's on, look out. Now, why did he do that? A move like that's low. It's appalling, if you ask me. Totally disrespectful. Well, when he sees the belt, he likes to hit below it. Hey! And he fights out of it. He breaks the hold. He's not exactly popping up to his feet here. Well, what do you expect, Michael? Did you see what just happened? How much pain must the arm be in now? He is slowly getting dissected. The challenger not looking good right now. The champ clearly getting the best of him here. Yeah, but even more concerning is the fact that his finisher has failed to put his opponent away on two separate occasions. Well said. But if you're going to count him out right now, I'm willing to bet you'll be surprised how much fight he has left in him. Whoa! He's measuring. There's breakers, and then there's breakers. That was the ladder. Yeah, that was the best breaker I've ever seen broken. Very, very painful hold here. What's he going to do? This is what makes him one of the best in the business. This hold is... Whoa! And he fights his way out. It's safe to say he underwent special training to put on this kind of aerial display. Yeah, or maybe it's just natural ability. <laughs> oh, wait. Nice reversal. Oh, he missed. Oh, -ho, nobody home that time. Oh, man, and I can guarantee he'll think twice about doing that again. You don't want to get caught outside the ring for... My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. Man, I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. The challenger not in a great place. The challenger is starting to feel the pressure of this high. Pr He's got the shoulders down, Cole. This could be it. Now back to the ring. Just trying to goad his opponent into making a mistake here. Oh, a reversal. Oh. He may have discovered his favorite move. You think? He seems to use it often enough. The more punishment he takes, the slower and slower he is getting back to his feet. Well, I've never seen him do that before. How much more punishment needs to be dished out? Just finish it! We may be looking at the beginning of the end here for the challenger. Let's not watch it! Here he goes for the win! Let's do this! He's making a statement here with this attack. Few superstars are as dominant as this guy. Oh, take a look at that. We haven't seen that one tonight. I love hey, it. this could do it. Maybe it. Two. 
These guys are giving it absolutely everything they've got. They're not holding anything back, and I love it. Whoa! Shoulders down. Championship on the line. It all started in 1988 when SummerSlam emanated from New York City. The main event for that inaugural event, the Mega Powers versus the Mega Bucks. Boy, he just got laid out. Just making his presence felt there. At this point, you think he'd have that move well scouted. Going to have to compartmentalize some of the pain that's been dished out. He could pin his opponent right here. I think this is it. Back in the ring now. A textbook reversal. Can he follow up? This is what makes him one of the best in the business. A move like that is completely unnecessary. Unless you want to degrade your opposition, of course. I agree, Cole. I mean, this is intentional humiliation. One. Two. He got the job done. This one's over. Representing the family, Hicks. Oh my gosh, new champion. And will things in the WWE ever be the same again? You're right, I think the entire landscape of the WWE just changed. And on top of that, there's a new champion in the WWE. And the crowd here tonight still in awe over that.